So you're probably searching for a video. You wanna convert your dull stock Harley Davidson lighting to some really awesome LED, very bright, stylish lighting, plug and play. You've definitely come to the right place. Stick around. Zero 3D, these are Fang front and rear LED light inserts, guys, for Harley Davidson motorcycles. I want to thank Zero 3D for their continued support of this channel. Welcome back, Bikeaholics. Ryan Erlocker here, lawabidingbiker.com. Thank you for checking back in. So, basically, what this product does is it converts, and the install is pretty easy. It's plug and play, but I will go through it with you. Um, so, basically, your front signals here, of course, are amber. Uh, light stock on your Harley Davidson and they're kind of running all the time and you just have that amber to the front They're a regular bulb. They're not that bright stock same with the rear except they're red You can see this light completely clear guys um, As far as it looks now now when it lights up of course on the front when you're just running down the road It sits up in here and it's constant on but it's white light so it supplements your headlight That's what's so cool about these so it's gonna supplement white light instead of wasting it with amber, all right? And then as soon as you turn your signal on, right or left, it's gonna flash amber because that's required for front signals. Very, very cool design. It's got the bevels. Of course, it's beveled out in the front. Um, very nice and it narrows down at the bottom. And again, I'll show you how to mount this here in just a moment. Now, their rear ones are basically exactly the same except, um, of course, they're red. In color, let me show you how to how to uh, actually install these things. Don't forget, we are a Zero 3D distributor right in the Law Abiding Biker store. LawAbidingBiker.com forward slash store. Get hooked up, help support us. Any Zero 3D product you see on this video or any of our other videos, we've got it for you. So these are stock Harley lights. They all are pretty much the same, front and back. You're looking for a little notch. It's gonna be somewhere around the outer portion of this lens. Mine happens to be right here directly on the side. Simple stubby screwdriver, flathead, and I'm just gonna put it in there and twist. That pops off the lens. Now we've got our stock bulb. I've got gloves. If you're gonna reuse these or give them to buddies to use, you don't wanna get your greasy fingerprints all over it. Simply pushing in, you'll feel it spring-loaded when you push directly back. I'm turning it counterclockwise, about an eighth of a turn, and then it will release and come out. You see there's two little nubs on the light bulb there. One's farther forward, one's up high, and this looks, this is the new uh, uh, Zero 3D Fang LED light insert, and it looks very, very similar to the back of the bulb, which why it makes it so awesome and so plug and play. Before I put this on, I'm gonna take a little dialectic grease just to protect it from the weather and the elements, protect the uh, contacts and all that. I've got my stubby screwdriver again, and you'll see right on the back of this thing is a slot for a screwdriver, right where we're gonna turn it and twist it in. Now, these can only go in one way, just like the light bulbs themselves. As I stated, the nipples or the tabs there are offset. So if you put it in the wrong way, you're not gonna feel the spring go in and you'll know you're wrong. And so you look for the channels to put this in, where the, there's two channels where the little nubs go, once you get those in, you push and turn, and I don't have it the right way there. And that's exactly what I'm talking about. So I'll turn it 180 degrees, and I'll wait and feel for the channels. It went in there, and it turned. I pushed in and turned an eighth turn. Now it's locked. I can't pull it out, so it's properly installed. Now on the back of this is just tabs, and these tabs obviously lock into the housing. I want to position it so that the thick part is at the top, the thick part, because the bottom part is the thin part, and that's the look, the fang look. And I'm just bunching the wires up, and then we'll get this locked into place. So I've got it positioned how I want, and I'm just trying to work all the tabs into the housing. Takes just a little pressure there. I got them all lined up. And then, of course, you can twist it a little bit, like I'm doing there, to get it lined up exactly up and down. And there you go, installed. Now, I've got to do that for the other side front and both the rear install exactly the same. And I just want to mention real quick that after you do install 
these uh, Ciro 3D LED light inserts, your dash light. Uh, your signal indicator is going to flash very quick. And just like that, I have new badass Ciro 3D LED light inserts on my Harley. Pretty sweet. I really hope you appreciated this completely free video, guys. Don't forget, if you appreciate it, subscribe to this channel so you're notified when we come out with new free videos because we have a ton in the works for you guys. Don't forget to like it, give it that thumbs up, share it with all your biker friends. I hope you're well, and I definitely hope you are out there getting some riding in. Peace out.